During COVID, online learning made a huge leap forward as people were forced to adapt to distance learning. Bearing that in mind, many people have started distance teaching. And if you are using LearnBase to do so, Paymedic has got you covered. You just focus on your teaching and leave all your payment stuff to Paymedic. How? You say? Well, let's show you how. In the beginning, in the beginning, head over to the Integrations tab from your Paymedic dashboard. Enable the Learn Dash Integration module by toggling this. No API key is needed, so you don't have to go the extra mile to get the API key. The integration is just a click away. Let's create a form by clicking Add New Form. We're gonna go with a simple form, so click on Create Blank Form. The name and email field is enough for a simple form. Feel free to add anything that you need. Once your desired form has been created, hit Save. Make sure to save your form before we head to the next step, as this is really crucial. Once saved, move to the form integrations. Since we have already enabled the LearnDash integration module, it will appear in this drop-down section among other enabled integration modules. Select LearnDash integration from this list. Configuration options for the feed will appear in the next window. You can change the feed name if you want. Select the LearnDash course you want to associate this form with. By default, the option to send a welcome email to new WordPress users is enabled. Feel free to untick it if you don't want to send the mail. Refunding a course means revoking access to that course, right? Yes, so? Well, for this exact purpose, just tick this option right here. This will automatically remove the user who chooses to refund or cancel the subscription. Sometimes, you might want to give access to the users even if they didn't buy the course. Especially if you publish a course for free, bearing in mind to promote your courses or website. Well, in that case, feel free to skip the next option. But if it's not, Tick here to enroll your users only when the payment has been successful. Well, that sums it up for this video. Or does it? It surely doesn't because we're not done yet. There's another great feature, conditional logic. This will help you give access to users to various courses with a single form that triggers based on the user's action. The conditions only appear when the action has been triggered. You'd wanna have to set up multiple integrations if you want this to work though. Once all is wrapped up, make sure to check the status before creating the feed. Whether it's enabled or not, this should be enabled by default. So, no need to worry if you haven't actually disabled it. But if you have, then enable it and simply hit Create LearnDash Feed. Well, now that sums up the video. See, told you Paymedic will do everything for you. All you have to do is create teaching content and a few simple clicks to set up Paymedic. Simple, right? Make sure to subscribe to WP Manage Ninja and hit the bell icon to see more videos like this.